Greetings, true friends. Welcome to <clears throat> Surprise Flex. It's the most potent and glorious of flexes. Comment below if I got you. So anyway, long time since I surprised you all with a Surprise Flex. Either way, this is my traditional birthday video that I make every year since time immemorial. Now that I'm on a venerable ancient, I've come to bestow some enlightenment upon you. First and foremost, new releases at Legio Gloria, including this fine stringer. The t-shirt, of course, is the main garment. Absolutely aesthetic, organic cotton made in Poland. Proudly made in Poland, I should say. Check it out, first link in the description box below. Now, I thought to mention something, and that is, if you read my book reviews, you are the very best person possible. If you don't always read all of my articles, what can I say? You must redeem yourself, you must fast for 40 hours in penance of this heinous crime, and then you need to read the book reviews I have up at the moment. They're quite informative if I may be so bold, and if you take the time to read them, I'm sure you will agree. So, that being said, I thought to talk a bit about getting older, as it were. I thought to just answer a question, and that is if I feel any different now when I am 3200 years. I'm an immortal elf, you see. If I feel any different from when I was 22. And uh, I can honestly say that I do feel better in basically every way now, at least, you know, biologically, physically speaking. If I were to say something that is not as good, perhaps, is that you get um, you get a bit less naive uh, with the years, especially if you've taken the path I've taken. And becoming less naive is, of course, not something necessarily bad, but... I've talked about all of this before, I've in recent videos and in podcasts, episode number 3, I talk quite a bit about it, so I won't go into detail here, and I won't make this into a, something that focuses on the negative, but yeah, with with age you will also have a, you'll gain a deeper understanding of humans based on experience with uh, people. Now to balance this negative view, I can also say that I've gained a a deeper love for certain people also, who have been supportive of me. Now, speaking in purely physical terms, I've trained quite hard the last 10 years or so. I've never been injured, and I haven't been, you know, taking it easy, so to speak. I haven't been particularly careful with uh, my body in regard to gym, strongman, uh, MMA, etc. But the um, main point here is that invest in your physical toughness and you will uh, gain from it. I've talked a bit about Warhammer in posts on social media and also in my podcast and I thought to give a good example here on the at least how it used to be back in the day you had characteristics for each um, uh, for each model and uh, toughness was one uh, such characteristic. You could have an orc for example and he had a high level of toughness which meant that he wasn't particularly he wasn't better at fighting or he wasn't necessarily stronger, but he was tougher, which meant that he could withstand more punishment. And I've always kept this in mind so that when you train your body, uh, you will be able to be healthier, uh, especially if you sit down a lot. Um, maybe it's not the best uh, metaphor, I have no idea, but I thought it would be fun to mention at least the, the orcs and dwarves being really tough can withstand more punishment. Same thing if we're talking about the mind, the, shall we say, more stoic uh, your mind, the better capacity you have for dealing with negative things, the better, uh, the more punishment from life you can uh, you can take, so to speak. So what I envision it as, you know, if I meditate upon life itself, I view it as a relentless slugfest. Life itself gets in a few hits on you, then you just have to brace yourself, uh, take it on the chin, and then try to hit back even harder. Now, that was a bit of a tangent, talking about your mental well-being, etc. But, you know, your physical and mental well-being, they are closely connected, because mind and body are one. Now, I thought to mention something as well in regard to, again, the purely biological aspect. Now, I haven't been sick in a very long time, 
10 years ago I used to be sick more often. I'm talking about man colds, etc. And I will credit my beloved wife for uh, taking so well care of me. She cooks very very good food and of course the the food is to a very large extent responsible for how um, how well your immune system works and how well you feel, how well you can perform mentally and physically. Now I can't really compare myself when I was 22 to where I am at now because you know the male brain at least it doesn't uh, stop developing until you're 25 or something like that uh, but I would say that I am extremely much sharper now than I was 10 years ago so um, when I meditate upon it I I sometimes think it would be fun to go back and, and redo my studies just, just to do it again but with a much sharper mind. Now of course I reserve my mental sharpness to writing books and um, developing products etc so uh, it's all good it's all good and of course I need to perform physically as well but again they go hand in hand I notice that when I perform well in the gym I do also perform well in um, in matters of the mind so to speak so anyway I just thought to check in saying that so if you're worried about getting one year older for whatever reason, just realize that things can also be a lot better than they were. So as long as you continuously improve yourself, as long as you take care of yourself, try to get a bit stronger, try to gain more experience, try to read more, enlighten yourself, etc. Things will be better. So that being said, I initially thought about making a wild hunt challenge video, but I will save it for um, tomorrow or in a few days we'll see how it um, when I will make it but it will be good as always always nice to see wild hunt challenges and uh, speaking of physique Friday thank you to everyone who posted physique yesterday on gab always warms my heart to see very white pilling if anything so anyway that all being said thank you for watching and thank you for all of your well wishes it um, warms my heart and um, yeah now i will cake max thank you all for watching and thank you for your support xxo boom